we are given that the length of vector a is equal to 3, the length of vector b is equal to 4, the length of vector c is equal to 5, also vector a is perpendicular to b plus c, therefore a dot b plus c is equal to 0. Similarly, b dot a plus c is equal to 0 and c dot a plus b is equal to 0. Now the square of the absolute value of vector a plus b plus c can be written as the dot product of vector a plus b plus c with itself. The right hand side is equal to a dot a plus a dot b plus c plus b dot b plus b dot a plus c plus c dot a plus b plus c dot c. This can be rearranged as the square of absolute value of vector a plus the square of absolute value of vector b plus the square of absolute value of vector c plus a dot b plus c plus b dot a plus c plus c dot a plus b. The first term is equal to 3 square or 9. The second term is equal to 4 square or 16. The third term is equal to 5 square or 25. And the last three terms are all equal to 0. Therefore, this expression is equal to 9 plus 16 plus 25, which is equal to 50. Taking the square root, the length of vector a plus b plus c is equal to the square root of 50 or 5 root 2, which is the required answer.